you guys are back for another video today I'm going to show you how I created this groovy flower and I hope you guys enjoy this video to start off I started off with LA color color craze um, and it's a gel polish and the name is rockin it shana glazed and the name is Japanese coal and it's a neon orange for my image plate, I am using CC and CC, and this one is number 23, and I'm using this image right here. For my stamping polish, I am using Mundo de Uña White number one. For my stamper, I am using Creative Shop UV Cheek, and also the scraper. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start um, applying polish on my plate. I'm going to be stamping my ring finger. There's the image. I'm placing it right about here. Okay guys, so this is how the flower came out. Not quite as the same as this one, but that's okay. And now we're going to go ahead and stamp only one flower on this finger here so you don't need as much polish as you need for the first time it is there's the image and I'm just gonna go ahead and clean with my mini limb roller Be careful, you don't want to ruin the image and then you're going to have to go ahead and do it again. Okay, and there's the flower. Now we're going to be applying that flower to this nail. So I'm going to go ahead and use Went Wild, just clear, and apply some not much just a little bit so the flower can stick to my nail because by now my flower is already dry okay then we let it dry for a second or two you can blow on it if you want like i'm doing so the process can be faster Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and stick it right along here. And there it is. It's not quite the same as this one, but it's fine. Okay, so now we're going to use the China Glaze. And here I'm using a dotted tool, and this one is the size that I'm using okay right there and I'm also using the smaller size you want to use the big one for the big flower just like that and now I'm going to be using the other side Now we're going to go ahead and let that dry and then we're going to add some sashvi and I'm going to go ahead and clean around my nail here with a L'Oreal brush. I found this brush at the Dollar Tree lip brush and I paid like a dollar for it. I like it. It's working good for me. I'm just going to go ahead and clean around here. With 100% acetone. I keep forgetting to say that I use 100% acetone for my cleanup. 
and also to remove my polish and I also use it to clean my image plates okay that's good enough okay so now I'm gonna go ahead and add my top coat and I usually grab a good amount Okay, and I keep coming out of frame. So here we are. Okay guys, so this is how they come out once you're done. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Um, subscribe to my channel if you like and I hope you come back for another video. Thank you subscribers. Bye